Roller, shout out to Hoop Journey. Yo, what is going on guys? Julian from Hoop Journey. Make sure you guys like the video, subscribe to the channel. Tonight, the NBA season has finally started. And we start off with Cleveland versus Celtics. Kyrie Irving returning to Cleveland. Jay Crowder, Dwayne Wade making their debut for the Cavs and Derrick Rose as well. And then just, man, prayers for Gordon Hayward. That injury was terrible, man. But yeah, getting into the numbers for the Celtics. Kyrie Irving in his Celtic debut, 22 points, 10 assists. Four rebounds and three steals. Very nice game. Got hot in the first quarter. There goes Gordon Hayward's first points as a Celtics. His only two points of the game. Unfortunately, that injury, man, that just really sucks. You never want to see that. Jason Tatum in his rookie debut, 14 points, 10 rebounds, three assists. Not too bad from the rookie. And then Jalen Brown just went off with 25 points, six rebounds. You see him there on the slam. LeBron getting out of the way. If this was a playoff game, LeBron James definitely would have jumped up with him. But here goes that scary, nasty injury for Gordon Hayward. Just trying to catch a lob. Landed terribly. And they gave him a fractured ankle there. Ah, man. Just hurts to even see that. You can see all the players' reactions. Just not something you want to see happen, especially in your debut game. Only six minutes into the quarter. And something so unfortunate like that happens. You see Tristan Thompson and most of the players' reactions. Just not a good sign for Hayward, man. Unlucky. Prayers up to him. Jalen Brown cannot believe it. And yeah, man, just, just really sucks. He only played five minutes, 15 seconds before the injury. Dwayne Wade there. Cannot believe it either. But getting back to the game, LeBron James wants that another MVP in his resume. Finished off 29 points, 16 rebounds, 9 assists, and 2 blocks. Shooting 2-19. and Very good game from the King. Played 41 minutes as well. Just a huge night from LeBron to lead the Cavs to the first W of the season. Finished off the 192-99 to for the win. The Celtics did come back. You know, after Hayward got injured, you could just see the energy was taken out of every player. Nobody wanted to even play. And it was just not looking good. The Cavs went up huge. They won in a big run. And uh, Dwayne Wade in his debut to play 28 minutes. Only had 8 points, 3 assists, and a rebound. Not too big of a night for him. But I'm sure he'll bounce back and have a big game eventually. D. Rose finished off 14 points, 4 rebounds, 2 assists. Not too bad. 5 for 14 shooting. Not that good either. J.R. Smith off the bench. 10 points, 4 rebounds. Very nice game off the bench, you know. Not enough numbers, but, you know, once he gets hot, you know, he can drop 20 a night easily. J.R. Smith and then Jay Crowder had a nice game. 11 points, 5 rebounds, 2 assists, 2 steals. Just can do everything for you, especially he's a really good defender. Kevin Love, 15 points, 11 rebounds. So the Cavs, you know, they it was a very good start of the game. This was just a very good game in general. Very close game. Came down to the wire. But you can see here Cleveland already up 41-28. Jay Crowder with the big three to push that league up even more. But, uh, you know, the Celtics in the second half just came out on fire. Wanted to come back into this game. Still in the second quarter, though. LeBron James, what a pass to Jay Crowder, man. He has crazy vision. The best passer in the league for a while now. And, uh, yeah, man, nice little shot there to go in. And the Celtics keep on fighting their second best player on their team out of the game and you know this you thought this game was going to be a blowout by the way it was going but the Celtics kept fighting showing that they belong here and they can win games with or without Hayward and uh you can only imagine if Hayward was playing could they have won with with him on the floor they only lost by three points and their second best player wasn't playing so uh, you know the Cavs you know maybe not as looking as good as we thought but LeBron definitely is nice little step back for the easy two and, uh, yeah, he mostly got played by the night by Jalen Brown and Jason Tatum. And uh, Jason, Jalen Brown's a really good defender. But, you know, there's only so much you can do against the best player in the league right now. Nice little dunk. And uh, here goes Al Horford, one of the best passing big men in the league. And you already see here in the third quarter, 61-48. to 48, Celtics are out of this game. And here goes Jalen Brown. Nice little conversion. And uh, still an 11-point game. And then here go the Celtics on a run. Just fast break points, killing the Cavs. And look at that pass from Kevin Love. The three not going to go in. But what a pass from Kevin Love. And here goes Kyrie Irving. Just looking to put the ball in the hoop. And that's money from the three. And the Celtics cut this league down to 10 points. Jalen Jason Tatum making an eight. LeBron with a nice pass to Kevin Love, man. LeBron, man. Just a great passer. Big three from Tatum. 
And uh, the rookie, expecting a lot more minutes out of him now. And he's going to play a lot better because now there's more of a scoring option and scoring role for him now that Hayward's probably done with the season with a fractured ankle. But Tatum did start tonight. So, uh, yeah, the Celtics, man, just unfortunate injury. And uh, here goes Derrick Rose bringing up the ball right before the clock expires at the buzzer. Hits the three just to push this league back up to double digits. But here goes only a one-point game. Jeff Green with a huge slam from the assist with LeBron. And LeBron in the post, man. He's just three-on-one, four-on-one. It does not matter. This man will finish. Here goes Kyrie with the three. Just nice, friendly bounce to go in. Again, just pulling up. He had that hot hand in the fourth quarter. Just wanted to shoot everything. LeBron in the post. Almost gets that man on a poster, but nice ball awareness. They get the rebound. Easy two points. Under six minutes. Tie game. Kyrie with another three. Push this to a Celtic lead. Nice steal here. And when are people going to learn? You're not going to score on LeBron on the fast break. He's going to block that every time. Insane block. Chase down artist. LeBron is. And here we go. Cavs down by three. LeBron driving in. Nobody's going to stop him. He is too strong. Can nobody see LeBron? LeBron's even shooting threes and nailing them easily. One point lead for the Celtics gets pushed to a three from Jason Tatum, who was playing very well in the fourth quarter, making smart decisions. But he just really just let Kyrie take control. That's what Kyrie's there to do. And a couple more minutes left in this game. Nice pass for LeBron to finish on the oop. And uh, you see Celtics still have the lead. Nice pass from Kyrie. Jason Tatum again scoring in the post. And here goes LeBron, man. He just do everything by himself. Just feeding LeBron the post and the ball. And a big pass right there. And there goes Kevin Love knocking that one down. Big three. LeBron pulling up. This one, unfortunately, not going to go in. Ten seconds left. Can the Celtics hit it for the win? Looking for the shot. Does not go in from Jalen Brown. They do get the rebound. And here goes Kyrie at the last second and misses it. LeBron on him. And you see the friendship there. They hit him with a handshake. Hugged it out. These two guys are still friends. No bad blood. Cavs take the first W of the season.